If you're looking to make your courses and programs more affordable for your audience, but you don't really want to cut the price down per se, then creating a payment plan for a course or a coaching program is a great option to add to your business. So today I'm going to take you behind the scenes inside of Kajabi and show you how to get it all set up. It's really simple. If you want to take advantage of a free 30-day trial of Kajabi to play with the platform yourself, you can use my link profityourknowledge.com slash Kajabi. This is an affiliate link, so I get a small percentage of your investment in Kajabi, but there's no extra cost to you compared to if you went through Kajabi's website yourself. All this does is simply support me and this channel for referring someone to Kajabi. But when you sign up with my link, I'm going to give you instant access to a course I created called Kajabi Kickstart, which is going to help you set up and launch your online business with Kajabi in that first 30 days. On top of that, when you're inside of Kajabi Kickstart, you will have access to a free 45 minute coaching session with me where you and I both get to deep dive into your Kajabi account and I will be there to answer any questions you have about Kajabi, marketing, or even making your first sale with the platform. All of this is free and you can get instant access by going to profityourknowledge.com slash Kajabi or clicking the link down in the description. Without further ado, let's dive into Kajabi. To get started, we're gonna go over to the sales tab and then the offers sub tab. And that's gonna take you over to this page and we'll show you different offers and products that you have inside of here. These aren't actually your products, these are just the offers. So that's where you wanna focus because you can have one product with two different offers, one being a paid in full, one being a payment plan. So let's say that my sweet mini course, it's right now $200. Let's say that we wanted to make that a bit more affordable for people, turn that into a payment plan. If I already had the offer built, what I would do is go over to the more section and hit duplicate. And then we can call this payment plan, go to duplicate. And right away, that's going to create our payment plan. So I called it payment plan just so you can differentiate, like this is the paid in full, this is the payment plan one. It's not going to show up on the checkout page or anything, but by me, uh, hitting duplicate, what's nice is that it automatically recreated the checkout page. I will have to make a couple of small adjustments, but I don't have to build a checkout page from scratch for the same product. But what we do want to change right here is the price. Typically, if you have a paid in full option, they should get the best deal possible. The people who pay in full, you, they should get a discount, best deal possible because you just took massive action. So I'm going to reward you for that. The payment plan people they're not gonna get as good of a, as a deal because they're also paying incrementally over time. So let's say that it, you know, essentially it's a $200 product, 197. If we'll click here and we can change the price of this product and change what happens here. So we still, because I duplicated this, you can add another product. It already has the same product added in there, which in this case is my sweet mini course. Offer pricing is where we wanna go over to change it. We'll click edit. That'll take us right here and we can change this. See right here, uh, when I made that title, that's the internal title and that's optional. This is only what you're going to see inside of your dashboard. If you're picking in different sections of Kajabi, like I want this offer to connect over here, it's gonna make sure that you see the internal title. The regular title is what everybody else is going to see, your customers, your clients, etc. You can add a description, you can change a thumbnail if you want. It's, since it's the same product, just a different paying option for the same product, I would just leave it as is. When we scroll down, we're gonna have price details. Right here, it says one-time payment of $197. We'll click on payment type, and we can get a handful of different options. We're gonna click on multiple payment. So payment amount, this is the actual payment amount that we are going to have them pay per month. If it was in this case of a $200 product, I would bump it up at least $50 or even $100, you know, because they're paying over time. Let's just say we're gonna make it, instead of 197, the payment plan option, they're gonna pay a little bit more, it's gonna be $247 over the span of, let's say three months. Okay, so 247 divided by three, that's, 82.33333, so we'll just say $82, that's fine. Three payments, technically 82 times three would be 246, so they save a dollar, that's fine. Uh, we, can, we can leave that right there, 246 will be the maximum amount. And then you can change 
the uh, custom price text. This is what it's going to show. So right here, I would write uh, three monthly payments of $82. And then you could even write, technically it would be 246 uh, total. Okay, so you could write that. And then right here, you can decide what payment provider you want to use. Kajabi only uses Stripe. If you want people to put in their credit card information manually, uh, or they do PayPal as well. I don't have PayPal set up. This is just the partners program that I have just to give you quick examples. But those are the two payment options that you have, Stripe and PayPal. Uh, I have both set up on my main account because people use PayPal as well in the world, but most people just use Stripe to pay for products from me. Uh, limit the offer. You can say we only have a certain qual uh, quantity limit, or you can say we have a time limit available for this offer. Okay, so that's up to you. But we're just gonna say this is like constantly available. They have the paid in full or they have the payment plan option of $82. So go up here to save. Now all that information saved. We're gonna check out the checkout page. So right here, see it's a little bit different. In that one area where it said optional, I wrote three monthly payments of $82, 246 in total. Now the paid in full option, they get a better deal. So this is what that paid in full checkout page look like, $197 USD. It says at the top, this one, three monthly payments of $82. They're like, hmm, maybe I'll just go with that. It kind of makes more sense. I can pay it over the course of a couple of months, but I know I'm gonna pay a little bit more. I'm okay with that. Okay, so right here, we want to just kind of change up this text down here a little bit. So we'll say it's three monthly payments. So you right here, instead of yours today, you can say something like, get started today for just $82. And then over here, this was an example I had made earlier. It would say yours today for just 197, okay? Right here, they can put in their information. And as soon as they land on this specific checkout page, they're gonna have this option. So you will have two separate checkout pages. So we're gonna hit save. And when you're ready to share this link, let's say you have a sales page and you have two pricing cards, two options. People are looking at your page and they're like, hmm, I could do a paid in full or the other card next to it is a payment plan. You would just go up here to get link and click copy. And when you have those two buttons on your landing page, one's paid in full, one's the payment plan. With a button on it, you would just copy this link. That's all you really have to do. And that's how you can set up multiple payment options inside of Kajabi. If you're new and you're considering trying out Kajabi yourself, I'd highly recommend to try out my link, profityourknowledge.com slash Kajabi. You're gonna get a 30 day free trial, free course from me. It walks you through how to set your business up and you're gonna get a one-to-one -one coaching call with yours truly. And we can deep dive and help you get set up, make the most out of your 30 day free trial on Kajabi so you can be 100% convinced that it is the best platform to help you grow your online business. If you have any questions about setting up multiple payments or anything related to what I shared today, let me know in a comment below and I will do my best to answer it. And if it makes sense, enough people are asking one question, I'll make another video going into more depth. I hope this was helpful and insightful for you and I will see you in the next one.